coverage you can count on begins as just one day after former President Donald Trump rallied voters in Gwinnett County, Vice President Kamala Harris returned to rally voters in DeKalb County, along with former U.S. President Barack Obama and singer Bruce Springsteen. Archie Sashadri has more. A star-studded affair to rally Georgia voters in Atlanta. Because, folks, the election is here. It is here. It is upon us. And the choice is truly in your hands. Your vote is your voice. And your voice is your power. Whether it was through song or through speech, we heard from numerous speakers Thursday night at the Harris Waltz rally here in Atlanta. We heard from former President Barack Obama, Tyler Perry, Samuel L. Jackson, and even a concert by Bruce Springsteen. All of them echoing a very similar message to get out and vote. Georgia already beating record early voting, telling people that this would be a new way forward, painting how a Harris presidency would look completely different than a Trump presidency. Both candidates have campaigned heavily in Georgia over the last few weeks to earn those six 16 electoral votes. Vice President Kamala Harris back in Atlanta for the second time this week advocating for abortion rights. One does not have to abandon their faith or deeply held beliefs to agree the government should not be telling her what to do. Not the government. The When We Vote, We Win rally talked about the fight for freedom, the fight for women, and creating new opportunities for a new America. Harris reminding Georgians what's at stake, focusing on moving America forward and saying she will be a president for all Americans. Reporting in Atlanta, Archit Tashadri, Atlanta Bureau Chief.